down there. Okay, okay, Margie. Oh, oh, well done. Good boy. Oh, good boy. Well done. Nice. I like it. Well done. How are you doing? Good to see you. Good to see you. How are you? How are you? Hello, Margie. How are you? Hello, Herc. Hello, Hercules. How are you? How are you? Ah, well done. Okay, okay. Kiss your mama. There you go. He's going to have a baby. Oh! I didn't like that very much. I didn't like oh, that very much. Oh, he's all right. He's is he all right? Uh, is he all right? He's a right Irish bear, you know. Is he a right Irish bear? He likes a wee drop of whiskey. Oh, does he Aye. indeed? But he's come to the wrong place. I can tell you that's what <laughs> Sit down, Mark. Can you leave him there or do yes. you want... Okay, leave him there for a moment. Sit, sit down. Sit beside you, man. Come on, Pop. Yeah, all right then. Okay, now. Now, don't let's disturb him too much. I'm, I'm first ready to run. The rule of the... The rule of the house says you know the bear is getting out of hand when you see me disappearing down that way. No problem. It's women and children first after Gabo. That's the rule of the house. How did you come... How old is he? He's nine years old in December. And how did you come together, Mandy? Well, I was wrestling in America. You know, I'm a professional wrestler. I was wrestling there, and I went home with a bear in America called Terrible Ted, yeah. which an Indian had was a black bear. Yeah. And I was skint, had no money, and you got $1,000 to have a go with him. Yeah. So I went on, had a go with him, and that's where I got the feeling I really loved the on my own bear. Yeah. And that's where I got the idea. And, and, and you, you have him since a baby, have you? Yes, we bought him inside his mother's stomach before he was born, paid for him in case they changed their mind, Away. you see? So then we, we bought him and we got him at 10 months old and he's turned out now to be the most famous bear in the world. Indeed he is. Listen, this guy has done more shows than I have. <laughs> he's been on every show in the world doing That's all sorts of things. Good he's boy. Really... Now, Andy, I have to say to you, talking to the Chipperfield family and various others in the circus world, they tell me that of all the animals, including lions and tigers and everything, bears are the most vicious, cruel animals to get mm. out of hand. Is that yes, right? well, you're looking at the most ferocious animal in the world today. As Hercules' is type of bear. But it's the way we brought him up. It's, we've no kids. He's part of the family. <laughs> he sits, watches television. He loves Tom and Jerry. <laughs> and he loves watching telly. He loves sitting in a wee drama at the fire. And that's how we've managed to... We, we never train him. He, he's not a circus, no. Yeah. All we've done with Hercules is got him away from the wilds to love people. Yeah. And you can see, this is what he loves best than running in the wilds. Yeah, well, he's all right kissing Margie and all that sort of thing, as long as he's eating. But when, when he gets sort of fussy and wants grub and so on... He'll he... go for you. He likes Irishmen. Oh, does he? <laughs> That's what I thought. I... But you've got to boil you first. You've got to put it in a pot. He doesn't I, like raw I, meat. I knew, I knew there was... <laughs> oh, really? Doesn't he like raw meat? No. You've got to box your cubes and everything and boil it all together. A stew? Aye. He'd love Dublin Bay Coddle, wouldn't he? In that, <laughs> that way. Slurp, slurp. Now, tell me about the time he was lost. He escaped from you and he went off... And well, the press him. said he escaped, but what he was doing, he was doing a commercial. Yeah. And I had him on a big long lead out in the sea with the seals. Yeah. And all that happened was his rope came off his neck. Now, where like was this? This is in the Hebrides, in the Hebrides of Scotland. Yeah. Yeah. And he went away for a wee swim, three miles away. And nobody seen him for three and a half weeks. And where, he was on the island? On it? the islands, on the Hebrides. Yeah. Trying to get home and he couldn't get his way home. And why couldn't you find him? Well, he's the same colour up there as the heather and that one, and he couldn't see him. <laughs> nobody, nobody saw him at all. Yeah. And the most amazing part of the story is... Hackley's never killed a rabbit to survive. He lived on his body weight and he lost 15 stone of weight and wouldn't kill to survive. But surely he killed birds or... or, or no, he loves, he loves people and he doesn't know how to do it. He doesn't want to do it. And, and, and in the end, then, after three and a half weeks, what happened? Well, there was a thousand pound reward out yeah. to anybody who could see him. And my wife's family lives up in the Hebrides and I was staying there looking for him every day. But the funny thing, he went to an old crofter's house and sat, sat at the window and started to cry okay. because he was dying. He knew he was another week and he'd been dead. But I'm, I'm mad at him because why didn't he cry at my the house I was staying? I would have to give the thousand pounds. <laughs> he's a villain. So the crofter got the thousand quid. He got the thousand quid. Get away, isn't that right? He's I a rascal. I can't believe that he didn't And kill I would like any... to say also the Yellowstone Park in yeah. America phoned yeah. the Times in London and said that Hercules would kill within two days. Yeah. So they've got to go back to the table about bears, because yeah. they're all wrong. Now, is he happy doing what he does? I well, mean, look at him. Well, of course, yes, as long as he's Well, you don't see any muzzles on him, chains yeah. on him, no. tranquilized, nothing. No. He's part of the family, yeah. and he loves his life. And he's done commercials, and he does all sorts of things. Now, what are you doing in Dublin? You're visiting some of the stores here. Yes, a couple of the big stores. Yeah. yeah. We're, we're visiting Switzers on Monday. Switzers on Monday. Yes. You'll actually be inside the store. Yes, we're, we're leaving the cavalcade when Santa comes yeah. through the town, and yeah. then we're off down to Cork. Yeah. So we're all looking forward to that. And what are you doing in Cork? Uh, is it another, another store? Another Santa Switzer parade? store, yes. We plug there. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, great. So, so you, now he sleeps. They have a beautiful, big, luxury touring coach outside, and half of it you live in, 
Yes. And then the, the other half he lives in. Ah, but this yeah. rascal comes in sometimes when you're in your bed. Jumps in the bed beside you. I could do without that. For a start. That's right. I don't think I'd like that at all. If you had a night with him, you wouldn't look at your wife again. <laughs> <laughs> but he's... But he's a real character, you yeah. know. He's part of the family, but not, we should all be proud of him. Scotch okay, people. you're going to do a bit of wrestling with him then? Go on. I don't know if, he'll, if he on, wants to do a wrestle. Well, have, have a wee see. Have a rest. Go on, have a rest. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, you see. Yeah, okay. I just don't know. Where's he going now? Hey, you rascal, you. I thought, yeah, can't have a Mind the furniture? The whole place is flooded. Is he for real? So far as if it matters. Oh, how are you going to this now? <laughs> I tell you what, Andy, let, let him up. Let him up. No, give, give over. Give him a drink. Give him a drink. Have you got a drink for him, Margie? Give him a drink for him. You rascal. Perk. 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 What, 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 what does he do? What does he do? That deserves a round of applause. I mean, you're exhausted, you poor devil. Poor devil. Come well, look at me. What, what, what does he drink? Well, he likes a wee dram, like all these Scotsmen. Yeah. Trying to keep him off the hard stuff. Yeah, yeah. Uh, Give me the chicken. Hi. Hold on a minute. All right, don't, don't worry. Listen, when I get my bread back, yeah, yeah. you know how the Irish people and the Scotch people are very brave? Yes, yes. Well, to prove to all the Irish people that you're brave, yes. I'm going to put a wee bit of chicken in your mouth, and I want Hercules to take it out. <laughs> Give me a round of applause and you make me do it. Let's go, go. Let's go, go. Let's go, man. Let's go. Oh, yeah. Oh, good, good, good. Yeah, yeah. Uh, wait, 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 wait a minute. Let's go, man. Uh, yeah, this is not a gag now. No, it's no gag, no. Let's go, man. Let's go, let's go. Good boy. Good boy. Fantastic. Okay, let's go. Yeah, yeah, well, I wouldn't want to do that too often. Get off my running order, will you? I haven't said. Okay, right, Herky. Right, Herky. Advoca. Yes. Just neat advoca. Yes, he loves it. It's good for his coat. He gets a bottle every night. I know what <laughs> he's happy. He's a real Scotsman. And we're feeling sorry for him? Uh, <laughs> you kiss. Hey! Yeah, watch yeah. the television camera, yeah. Herky. Uh, watch the monitor there. Oh, ahead. Jesus, what okay. about it? <laughs> <laughs> the island is not swear. All right, give him the drink, for God's sake. We give in, Herc. There's no argument. It's okay now. Make him sit nice. Yeah, yeah. I, will, I made a wee fib once when I came to Ireland. I would like to confess to the people. Yeah. Nice. When I was wrestling over here, yeah. I changed my name to Paddy O'Reilly. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I told a wee fib. Good boy, Herc. Good boy, Herc. Well done. Well done, Herc. Fantastic. Well, while well, well, he's occupied, it's all right to scratch him and fondle him and everything else because he's more. You don't have to hold it up for him, no? No, he holds it himself. He's even got a new tie today. This is for, special for his trip to Ireland. He got a new tap and tie. <laughs> you better mention that nice lady who was on the. You look great for yes, oh, yes, you better mention well, it. Can well, I say well. that the lady, Christine. Christine. Gallagher helped us through customs. Oh, really? And uh, she said that if I didn't mention her, that she wouldn't let us back. She, she's a customs lady. <laughs> she's right. a customs lady, I see. Very, and she helped you through. Yes. <laughs> Would you argue with him? I ask you. <laughs> Good boy, oh, dear, oh, dear. All right, well, it's lovely to meet you. Thank you very much indeed, Herc. Let's go to Gallagher. Here. Thank you very much indeed, Herc. Here, 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 here. Hey, Psst. it's advocate. It's neat advocate, kid. Come on. Here, have a, have a go. Have a go. Oh, I you think. <laughs> what a time to take the pledge, you dope. <laughs> Come on, yeah. puppy, we've got to go now. All right, you've got to go. Uh, Andy, thank you very much indeed for coming. Lovely to meet you. All right, Margie, thank you thank very you. much indeed for coming along. Andy and Margie Robinson, Hercules. All right, you can. Yeah, you better take that. I don't want you to sit around. All right, here you go. Off you go. So long. Yes, Herc, it's time to go. I'll tell you something, Maggie. 
he's not going to go. Yeah. Goodbye, oh, Herc. Really, yeah. Goodbye, Herc. What a relief that is. I mean, you, uh, if he doesn't, if he decides not to go, I mean, he's here for the night, you know. Have a good smell there, Herc. That's our camera. That's all right. You're all fine. Just mind your legs now as he passes by. He might suddenly turn vicious. Thank you very much indeed, Andy and Marjorie. Thank you.